So what did he do? What did he do? I didn't see the move. Oh, he just took. Yes. Yeah, now bishop takes d5. And... Uh, b3, maybe. Yeah. And b3, and... Okay. But this is... Still this is uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's a very unclear position. Passive, 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 yeah. passive, yeah, yeah. See, it's not enough to avoid blundering pieces and, uh, you know, making downright mistakes. You have to fight for everything else. So that was another resignation. Is that right? Shaking his head for. But he might let's, be also still thinking about a game. Yeah. Because he. Yeah, no, it could be sometimes people yes. shake their head for a previous position yes. and then they're, 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 they're annoyed because of that. Uh, no. I'm sorry. That's. Uh, Quintens, uh, rook g8 doesn't really... Yeah, I understand what was the idea, because he was thinking about the f6, Six. yes. Yeah, but f6, f6, sort of f6, a, f6, 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 prophylaxis to f6. Well, it's but, a super, uh, super prophylaxis. F6 is not going to but happen. But Gary yeah, just, just opened the vein. He's just, so. just blasting open the position. Fortunately, he's let's playing go, with go, three pieces let's, more. Let's go to the, the next one, because this is actually, actually much more interesting. Um, this queen is is very good on. He's this kid is. I mean, he can play chess. He plays very nicely. Good centralization, defending yeah. on on h8. He slightly botched up in the in the middle game, the beginning of the um, the the middle game. He. So what would happen on rook h1? We might rook just H1. analyze d5, it. Rook h1, d5, d5, just push forward. Check, bishop h7, queen check, g7. Sorry, check? Bishop h7, king g7. g7, and just, uh, yeah, ah. so, so he's trying to avoid this yes. exchange of queens. Actually, it's very good move. Off, off Gary's. Yes. Now I it is a good move, yeah. I cannot see how to even to exchange a piece now. They have nice chairs. Yeah. And yeah, Chris Chris Peters has um has defended very well, but he's just going down slowly. That's basically you know, just not quite up to the mark, but uh, certainly not uh, disgraced himself by by any means in this uh, in this game. Yeah, I think he defended well. Yeah, yeah, just uh, unfortunately made that that weakness early on in the game and 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 got into a bit of trouble. So, uh, yeah. Some pieces dropping off. Oh, what happened here? Position was oh, deteriorated. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. And that is unfortunate because uh, Carol van Eidfeld had played. Um, in a very interesting way, enterprising way, and uh, had. Um, yeah, I think that like the major problem in quite of these games was that uh, they were stuck with the pieces which were not improving. So like like we've saw knights on a six. Uh, so that's true, actually. That uh, yeah, because um, very often if you have one 
badly placed piece, you have a bad position. Yeah, and, and sometimes uh, just it's sufficient to improve. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, it's like... Mm, queen, no, queen... Queen takes rook g1, and then I think... Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, dear. Yeah, oh, dear. Like the yeah. pressure. Yeah, the pressure, yeah, the pressure counted the... Yeah. Because there was still some. I think they're D5. D5 should be played. B3, as I said. So, and down Rook J, actually. Oh. Well, that's. Um, Knight H4, maybe the only move, and then H5. And what? F5. Oh, no, you have. Knight 6. F5. No, F5. Bishop G2. Bishop G2. Oh, this is exciting. So oh, he's, okay. tall, he's taking it, right. So F5, I Game think, on. is coming. Game on. After F5, Queen takes E5. How about that? I've got a tactical blow. Uh, oh, okay. that was the sneaky response. Yeah, that's it. Because it, it looks as if black is bursting out, but... You see, Gary's just a trickster. That's all he does, you know, just little cheap tricks here and there. You don't quite agree. No. Perhaps, <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps a... Uh, but I can understand that from now and then you would like to win a game easily because it's not so easy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sometimes you just want your opponent to make a mistake because you just... You're yeah. No, you it's want them to resign, and then... Of course, the guy plans very well, he plays strategically very well. But even when it goes wrong, then you've got the tactical <laughs> skills coming in. So you have to beat him in all departments, really, in order to... Uh, to deserve uh, yeah, the result. Yeah. Uh, now, unfortunately, okay. this C5, is... Yeah. This is Pretty grim that uh, uh, Thibault has uh, has got a very passive position. Defended uh, quite well, but it isn't. I didn't play. No, I didn't play it. Didn't play it. It was good enough. C5 was. Maybe Gary's just taken the view that he's winning anyway. You know, he can do what he wants. I think. Oh, I can see some tactics coming here. Yeah, Bishop f4 and mopping up. Oh, is that what happened? Oh God, that was the. Oh, oh, yes. oh dear, that was the one tactic which I said had to be avoided. Yes, you old foxes. Oh, yes, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, now the position, I think Gary has calculated quite far, because otherwise the position would become very sharp, so... Yeah, yeah. Are you calling me old, Almira? Did I uh, <laughs> understand that? That was a bit... Is it foxes? Yeah, I yeah, the yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, now that I'm the oldest player in the top 100, yeah, I chess I is becoming actually yeah, very yeah. young. <laughs> yeah, that's right. 45 years old, and I'm the oldest player in the top 100, which, you know, 45 in, in chess terms means that you are a dinosaur. But the old guys can still play a bit. Anand is not a spring chicken. They were a world <laughs> champion. He's in his 40s. Yeah. Oh, so there was an another oh, right. defeat. Yeah, yeah. I think the mopping up is well in progress. I think it's going to be another clean sweep. I've made two predictions now. So I've covered. I've said that Gary's going to drop some points, and I said no. I've said he's going to make a clean sweep. So. 
I'm going to be right, <laughs> one way or another. <laughs> I actually thought he, he was in some trouble earlier on. Yeah, well, not, in, not exactly in trouble, but I, I, I thought... And now he, he's you know, moving uh, now, my, much more confidently and... Uh, he looks like... We haven't seen the position of Jan Calvert. We don't yeah, know what is yeah, going on. Yeah. On the yeah, we don't know at all. Look, he's he's looking, looking at his watch. <laughs> yeah, don't look at your watch. Play the board. Dinner. Oh, Dinner. He's thinking, he's thinking, <laughs> yeah. I could do with a glass of wine myself, you know. That's uh, yeah. That's how. It, now he's going for mate. Yes. Yeah. This. Yeah. This looks like hake mat. Yeah. Yeah. Almost. That's it. And it's interesting because this line, Gary has won so many games in this particular line. This and. He picked this up from Botvinnik, you know that. I mean, Botvinnik was playing this this way in the Queen's Gambit declined, this position which we have here, Mark Dillon. You know. And it, it, it's just a question of superior planning. Botvinnik won these some of these famous games, like against Paul Keres, the Estonian. And, uh, and Gary's been... He's learned these classic games, and he's been cleaning up uh, ever since then. Of course, he adds his own twist. Of course, and that's and you can also see, like, learn from Mongari how to put your pieces on, like, on yeah. the optimum squares. They're yeah. always standing right. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, even when he didn't put it like on the C4, then he came back on D2. So, and then he's improving his pieces again. Yeah. Chess is like life, finally, it's about, all about harmony, so you should always... I thought life was about suffering. Oh. Maybe these people are learning what life is all about. <laughs> They're all suffering now, one by one. Yeah, this is the... Uh, uh, some sort of... No, knight f3. Yeah, knight f3. No, f6, 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 f6. Oh. Oh, oh. So F3 maybe now. Maybe. He has to calculate. F3 might be the... I think perhaps the bishop should have gone back the other way. It should, maybe the bishop should have gone to A8 or something. It's not... It's still some... some Slight problems. F3, yeah, Bishop H4. It's still not completely clear, is it? Can I mean, it's good. It's good for. Uh, yeah, I mean. I mean, you should neutralize the activity of yeah. I mean, F, so. F3 will leave, leave white clearly on top, but there is limited material left. And with limited material, this always offers some some sort of drawing chances. Yeah, but there are also a limited number of games left and this yeah, that's true. makes Gary stronger. That's true, and he's mm. uh, he's zooming round ever faster. Uh, he's having a think. Yeah, he's, 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 it's just a practical decision because... Um, yeah, he's... Uh, with this move, he's clearly on top. He doesn't take any. Uh, I think was that another game down? Uh, yeah. yeah, the game we didn't see. Yeah, we haven't had too much. Two games actually. Yeah, we haven't had too much emphasis round round here. a mate coming over on that uh, first board. And this is where it's when you're you're playing and I, I played on both sides of uh, exhibitions like this um, that it